Okay, that popped out twice. I'm going to leave that there and see what we got. So it says caught up. Then we have successful. We have haters. Karmic soulmate. Financial lax. We have sneaky. They only wanted to use you. We have panicking. And then we have very intuitive and then gold digger. So this person is, this could be you going through this, someone that you're attached to, someone that you've detached from. This could be different people that want to come towards you, different people that they're attached to. This is um, overall masculine and feminine energy, past, present, or near future. So you have to take what resonates and leave what does not. But somebody ended up getting caught up. This could have been a karmic soulmate, as this karmic soulmate is here. This is someone that was dealing with some type of financial lack, and they were being very sneaky. And um, this is someone that only wanted to use you or use, you know, the person that you're watching this for. This is somebody that was a gold digger, and they wanted to be successful. They thought that they would be successful, but they ended up getting caught. Somebody became very intuitive, and someone is panicking, whoever the sneaky person is. That was experiencing some type of financial acts. And this is overall Sagittarius. Sagittarius reading. Seven of Cups in the reverse. So yeah, this, this person, they got caught. Whoever they tried to do this to, this is someone that's very intuitive. And that person is panicking. It's like that person became very intuitive. They found out this person was a karmic soulmate. This person was someone that was, you know, going to keep them experiencing financial lacks. They were trying to be successful off of that person and trying to use that person. Two of Pentacles is here. Yeah, this is someone that always needed different people to balance situations out for them. And, you know, they target people that they think that have a lot of money. Ten of Pentacles is here. People that are wealthy, people that have wealth in their family, different stuff like that. Yeah, and this was like the ultimate betrayal. They betrayed that person, backstabbed that person multiple times with multiple people. And it was only because they knew that this person had a fortune. The will of fortune is here. They knew that this person would be successful. So they figured that they would gain something by staying attached to that person, but they ended up getting caught up. Yeah, two of swords is here. They were trying to blind this person from the truth. They could have tried to blind this person's family or your family or a group of people from the truth. They didn't want them to be able to see properly. Yeah, this person is dealing with some type of tower moment. Because this person had became very intuitive and they ended up getting caught up. They only wanted to use that person. Now they're sitting back going through a tower moment, a drastic change that they did not expect to go through after getting caught. Yeah, six of swords and five of wands. It's like this person is sailing away from this person. They look at this person as someone that was bringing conflict, chaos, and havoc. Secretly tried to one-up them. Secretly was in competition. Different stuff like that. And this is how they're looking at this person. Yeah, somebody that was possessed and obsessed. This person would have did anything to be successful. This person was someone that was very toxic. And now they're panicking. Yeah, five of swords in the reverse. It's like this person was being very tricky and they can't even be determined anymore. They could not sabotage this connection. They could not place this person under some type of mind spell or something like that, mind control. They wanted control over this person's mind. 
But they couldn't confuse this person as the Seven of Cups is in the reverse. This person ran out of whatever option that they had to try to trap this person. Because this person became very intuitive. Yeah, I can't make this up. Eight of Swords on the bottom of the deck. They were trying to trap this person to have them stuck because they felt like they would be successful off of this person. Yeah, now they're sitting back at the nine of ones. They did something over and over and over again to try to trap this person. To have this person feeling stuck. Uh, they tried to blind this person's family from the truth. And it's like they're being seen for who they are. This, the sun card is here. Everything got exposed. And that person is sitting back, you know, going through some type of tower after they got caught up. This person was being very sneaky. And now they're panicking. After doing something over and over and over again, they're sitting back panicking. Because this person is looking at them as a karmic soulmate. Someone that was very sneaky. Someone that was a hater. They did this for financial gain because they were experiencing some type of financial lax. And they were only trying to use this person. Yeah, two of cups is here. And then page of wands. So it's like, yeah, they knew that you and this person were supposed to partner up. They received some type of communication. They got some type of message. They could have knew that you and this person was working together or something like that. And they thought that they would, you know, do something very sneaky to try to have this person stuck. And they were determined. And it's like now they ran out of all the options that they had after getting caught. And they're panicking. Yeah, Six of Wands and Queen of Pentacles. You're in this Queen of Pentacles energy, someone that's very successful, Six of Wands. It's like you're having victory and success. This person wanted to be in your energy. They thought they would become a queen of pentacles. And um, they would be someone that was very successful. So it's like this person was at the five of wands secretly in competition with you. And thought they had one up you or something like that. Because they knew you and this person was supposed to partner up. Or work together. They could have knew that you and this person would build a ten of pentacles. Y'all had a, a destiny together. Different stuff like that. And they were trying to blind a whole bunch of people from the truth. And it's like now you're in the six of wands. You worked hard to get to where you are and you did it by yourself. And it's like this person thought they would have this person stuck, pin them down, backstab them, and they will walk off successful. Now they're panicking because they got caught. Yeah, King of Pentacles in the reverse. They were planning to take everything from this person. They didn't want this person to have anything. It's like they wanted this person to be someone that was just... Um, this was someone that was very money hungry. And they planned to take everything from this person and flip them in the reverse. This person could have went through some type of financial lack because they were attached to this person that was being very sneaky. And they were a karmic soulmate. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles is here. And then the Unknown card is here. They didn't want this person to know that they used this person um, to... They, they used this person to try to get them to give them something or for abundance, success. They didn't want that person to know. And they did not want this person to come towards you. Ace of Pentacles, the Unknown card, and the Chariot. They didn't want this person to come towards you and start over with you, be abundant with you, get what's destined for them, different stuff like that. They figured they would slip to knock this person in the reverse. This person realized they can't have anything around this person. They're dealing with some type of financial lax because of this person that they were attached to. Yeah, the high priestess is here. It's like this person was doing a lot of stuff that was hidden. And then judgment is here. Page of Cups. Yeah, they're trying to hide something. This person could be trying to hide something about a child. The pages are children. So they could be trying to hide something and they're under judgment. High Priestess, Judgment, and then Page of Cups. So whatever, the, this could have been this Ten of Swords, this ultimate betrayal. Whoever they were partnering up with, this person was trying to hide something about a child. Four of Wands is here. Yeah, because they they were trying to keep 
you know, keep their stability. They wanted this person to keep them um, stable with this four of wands. Yeah, justice is here, but justice is being served. It's like whatever this person did, they got caught. Nine of Swords is here, and they're stressed out. It's like they can't even sleep at night. They're all in their head. People are exposing them. People are gossiping about them, about whatever they did, because they got caught. This person was somebody that was trying to use this person for money, and they tr possibly tried to use a child, and now something is coming out about this child. This person could be finding out a child is not even theirs, as they were attached to this person. Yeah, Ace of Cups in the reverse. This was someone that was like unre unrequited love, somebody that they didn't love, and they figured they would trap this person with a child. And they were working hard. It's like they, they this person was working hard, thinking that this child was theirs. They didn't want this person to start over. They didn't want this person to love their self, and they definitely didn't want this person to have a relationship with you and start something new with you. Yeah, Knight of Swords is here. This person is pissed off and mad. They did something too quick and they ended up getting caught. This person is being seen as a karmic soulmate. King of Cups is here. Yeah, they're pissed off and mad. <laughs> yeah, they're pissed off. I'm just going to say this person has emotions for you and that's what's pissing them off. They could not get this person to be in love with them as the Ace of Cups is in the reverse. They thought they would use a child, get this person to be in love with them, use the child to, um, you know, get love from this person. And it did not work. And they're pissed off because this person is in love with you. This person feel like they have a strong connection with you. This person is being seen as a karmic soulmate. Yeah, this is somebody that they needed to cut off. Queen of Swords is here. They thought this person would just cut you off or something like that. Or they wanted this person to cut you off. They could have wanted this person to think that you were someone that was sneaky or something like that. Yeah, this is somebody that they needed to cut off. Queen of Swords is here. Yeah, and that's the truth, Ace of Swords clarity. You could have spoke truth. Queen of Swords and Ace of Swords, you could have spoke truth about this. You could have told this person that a child was not theirs or this person was going to try to uh, trap them or something like that. Or somebody else came in and spoke the truth. Take it where it resonates. About this person. You're someone that's very intuitive. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles is here. You're someone that's very self-sufficient, very intuitive, very in tune. You could be someone that reads tarot or something like that, or you're just very spiritual. You're mindful of different stuff. You went through a lot, so it's like you know a lot. And you're someone that's very successful. It's like you're someone that's self-sufficient, abundant, independent. You can read energy. So you could have been the person that told this person this. And this was truth and clarity, Ace of Swords. This person ended up getting caught. Yeah, everything backfires. Seven of Wands is here. They ended up blocking that person out. Everything backfired. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles is here. They were just trying to slow this person down. Slow down all movement around them. So they came in quick, Knight of Swords lied to this person and told this person that they were pregnant or a child was theirs or something like that. They did not expect for this person to go to the courthouse. Justice is here. Judgment is here and page of cups. They didn't expect for this person to get a DNA test. Yeah, and justice is here. This person went to the justice system. Everything backfired. They thought they were going to have this person under a seven of cups illusion and confusion and that's in the reverse. Yeah, three of wands is here. And ten of wands, the plan was to have this person at the ten of wands feeling pressured and weighed down and burdened. A lot of stuff in their face that they cannot see and a lot of stuff on their back that they cannot weigh. And this person will be running in circles throughout life as they're at the seven of cups and lose your confusion and their family is blinded from the truth. <laughs> this is sad. I can't. You just at least expect that people would do stuff like this. It's sad. I mean, I cannot see nobody sitting back saying, I just can't. Two of Wands in the reverse. It's like they could not cap this person at no stalemate. Not knowing which way to go or not knowing which direction to take. <laughs> I 
Oh, I'm so done. I can't. I just can't. Yeah, this person ended up going through a transformation. <laughs> and they put an end to the situation. This person did not expect to get caught. Now this person is dealing with some type of financial lax. I'm so done. Yeah, they put an end to that quick. <laughs> this is sad. Queen of Cups is here. Wow. And then the Empress is here. Yeah. They could have, they knew that this person was your um, divine counterpart. So they figured they can come in quick. Hey, I'm pregnant. This person would think that they were their empress or something like that. Or they were divine to be with them or something like that. This person found out quick this was a karmic soulmate. And they were at the five of cups in regret, ashamed, embarrassed. They didn't even want to, they didn't even want to be around that person anymore. This person immediately got caught. Whatever they did. Yeah, this knight of wands energy. This was someone that was a knight of wands that came in quick and had sex with that person or tried to have sex with that person. Take it where it resonates. This person could have been in regret for having sex with this person. Yeah. Eight of Cups is here. And then Three of Swords. Yeah, this person could have literally... They walked away at the Three of Swords heartbroken because... They could have sat back and thought this child was theirs. And they waited and waited and waited until the child came. And then they found out the child was not even theirs. Yeah, this is sad. And they thought they had them blinded this person's family from the truth and had this person in the hangman energy. And it's like now they feel stuck after getting caught. They're in the hangman energy. And they don't even want people to see their face. They could have literally bragged to different people, had people thinking that they, you know, hey, when people first find out that they have a, you know, a baby on the way, you get your family involved. People start planning this and out, this and that out. But they they were behind the scenes doing something that was hidden. And they thought this person would never find out. They tried to play some type of illusion around this person and different people that they were attached to, but it did not work. This is sad. Yeah, a page of swords is here. And now this person is just stuck in the hangman energy, spying, watching, stalking. Wow. Three of Cups is here. Yeah, they'll be sitting back stuck in the in the um hangman energy when this person and you reconnect. Because this person did this because they didn't want this person to come towards you. So it's like they'll be sitting back watching and stuck or they wrap, they got wrapped up in something. This person could have literally got wrapped up into something and they were being watched. Wow. Could have been a group of friends with this three of cups. Yeah, this person could be literally under investigation. The hermit card this year and then the hangman and page of swords. This person was sitting back being watched whatever it is that they um, were doing. Because whoever this energy is, they're someone that's very sneaky. They're always experiencing some type of financial lax or something like that. And this person would do anything to get some money, a gold digger. So ain't no telling what type of um, illegal activities they were involved in. And they have been sitting back being watched under investigation and they did not even know. Yeah, five of pentacles is here. They were out in the cold on that knowledge. This person is someone that's very low vibrational. And they didn't know that they were caught up. Yeah, King of Swords is here. This is an investigator or a police officer or something like that is watching this person. And they don't even know this. Sitting back and observing them and everything. Wow. The Fool card is here and then King of Wands. Yeah. It's like this person is getting ready to take action towards you. They're on a whole nother path. This person is standing up and very in tune, very intuitive. And this person have learned different stuff about spirituality as well. And it's like they're going in a whole nother direction. Yeah, this person is going after whatever it is they want out of life. Yeah, Six of Cups is here. And these are events that took place in the past. This person is somebody that did not want this person to let go of the past. And they thought they were going to use a child to trap this person. And have this person stuck. Have different people around them blinded from the truth. And they wouldn't be able to see properly. 